Hi, thanks for stopping by my channel. Today I will be sharing with you two Elmasco polishes that I um, purchased from Hotlook.com. These retail for about 20 bucks, I think, and I got them for $7 plus shipping and handling. So if you would like to see what I got, please stay tuned. So Elmasco is a luxury high-end polish brand that you can purchase at. Sephora, I think, um, I don't because they're too expensive and I don't think that, um, polishers qualify or signify for that much. I usually just buy them f at resale stores or whenever I can get deals from them. I just wanted to try them out and these were two of the colors that stood out for me and I'm kind of glad I was able to get them. I really like this peach color right here and see if it'll focus. Um, this one right here is called Purity. It's so small, but here it is in the box, Purity. And um, this one is the Orange Cream Peach. I like it. I wore it for two days, and the formula is really nice and easy. I did not get any chippage or anything. This one right here is a Seafoam Green, and it is called Nomad. So if you would like to see how they swatch on live, please stay tuned. One thing I do want to share before I start swatching is that the cap does come off. And the brush on these is the normal one, but they are pretty wide. So I'll go ahead and swatch it, so stay tuned. So here's one coat each of... um. Nomad, which is this bluish seafoam green, mint green, I should say. It does remind me a lot of OPI's Mermaid's Tears, but I think this one is a bit brighter. So here is one coat. I will go ahead and get a second coat, and I will get back. So here is two coat each of Elamaska Nomad. Um... It is a pretty color. I do have something similar to it, but I don't think it's an exact dupe to it. So I am glad that I was able to pick this color and give it a try. One thing I do like to point out is that um, their bottle, you know how the shape is taper like this? When you apply it on, it's really comfortable. You it, um, When you apply it on, it's really easy to work with and it feels really, you know... How should I say it? It feels like it's meant for you to polish the polish like that. I don't know how to explain it, but because the cap is round and taper in the top right here, it makes the application really easy compared to a normal brush where it's just flat like this. I mean, this is long, but then it's f just... I guess you can see how it is that it does... Um get narrower on top so the, with the application when you hold it you tend to hold a, a brush like this and paint your nails but with this type of cap it makes application easier even though the cap is shorter and that's what I'm trying to say but I'm sorry if I'm blabbering so here is one coat of parity which is this peachy orange cream and for this I did not decide to remove the cap just so that you can kind of see how it is with the cap on. You can choose to keep the cap on or off, but I think I like it with the cap off. So here is one coat each. It is a bit patchy. I will go ahead and get a second coat and I will get back. And here is two coat each of Elamasca Parity. Like I said, the cap makes the application really nice. I really like the feel of it because it's round here and it's taper in the front. I know that's a little some people it does not matter, but for me it works. So I think that's going to be it for today. Thank you so much for stopping by. I hope you enjoyed this quick video and small haul. And today I would like to leave with a quote as well. And my quote of today is, Time is not measured by the passing of years, but by what one does, how one feels, and what one achieves. Thank you so much. Thank you so much for stopping by. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please comment and subscribe.
I am sorry that I'm rushing, but I don't have that much daylight left, so I just want to get this video in before the sun sets. So thanks, thanks again, take care, and see you next time.